Traders in the West End want Oxford and Regent Streets to be shut more often as the battle with huge shopping centres for Christmas trade begins. Although the roads will be shut this Saturday, businesses believe shoppers are attracted by a traffic-free experience. They argue centres like Westfield have an advantage by being spared the disruption. Robin Punt reports. Right, hello everybody. Ho, ho, ho. He's here, or rather, up there bearing glad tidings. A traffic-free day at Oxford Circus this Saturday. There'll be a pop group and, they hope, perked up sales. Oxford Street and Regent Street did the same over two days last year, pulling in 1.6 million visitors. And the mayor is keen to maintain the appeal of the West End. They're doing very, very well, but we've got to think of ways of making it even more attractive. So more street closures might be a, a good plan. You seem quite keen. You're sort of nodding and smiling. I'm keen in principle, but you've always got to balance the traffic impacts. And uh, obviously, uh, it's, Oxford Street is one of the, it's the Schleswig Holstein question of traffic problems. In other words, there's a power struggle for control of the streets, with echoes of a 19th century diplomatic spat between Denmark and Germany. <laughs> anyway, Rihanna turned the lights at Westfield Stratford on last night. The battle for Christmas shoppers is on, which is why the West End is so keen on keeping out that traffic this Saturday. I'm alive, we're like diamonds in the sky. Traders hope to take £100 million in a single day, using the peace and quiet to pull in the shoppers. That calmness, do you think that's some of what we like when we go to the, the out-of-town or the in-town shopping centres? Of course. Well, retail is all about, always about having a wonderful destination, an enjoyable place to take your family. And I think that the West End can provide that more often. Retail success is about presentation, festivities, keeping shopping special. That's why Saturday's traffic-free day in the West End is so crucial. It's the seventh here this year. Of course, after this weekend, it's back to normal. Oxford Street and Regent Street reopen to traffic, which leaves the West End with a dilemma. How do you compete with the shopping centres who can put on big events and special things far more easily when you have to contend with a busy high street? West End retailers predict they'll take £100 million on Saturday and over £7.6 billion in 2012 as a whole. Westfield say their annual takings in Stratford and Shepherd's Bush will top £1.8 billion. They are far smaller. But the battle for Christmas trade has begun. Robin Punt, BBC London News.